Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time watching, I'm Sheree, welcome. If you happen to be returning, you are truly appreciated. Thank you so much and welcome back. Today we are continuing with the collection from Roja that recently released. They released, I believe it was like six fragrances, you guys, and I received a few more, okay? More than a few more. So I am going to do like a first impression, a quick what I feel about these fragrances with you. There's no way I've had a chance to wear all of these and I can give you an in-depth detailed review but that will follow but I know that this is the time they are airier they are fresher they are lighter so I want to get this to you just to give you my initial first impression so if you're out and you want to pick them up you'll have a little bit of an insight of how they smell just in case you're not able to get out to stores or you're not able to get a sample first of all I was like OMG, okay, OMG, the packaging is beautiful, the bottles are superb. This is Roja Dove that we are talking about, you guys, and the fragrances are amazing. They are phenomenal, the quality, the craftsmanship, the bottle, it is just luxury. You know how I feel about luxury over here. If you don't, here on this channel, I do cover fashion, beauty, luxury, and lifestyle, and of course, all things fancy and fabulous dwelling. So if you like any of those things, or perhaps you might be like me, and you you too can appreciate all things fancy and fabulous go ahead and consider hitting the subscribe button smash the notification bell that way you will get an alert every single time there is a video placed on this channel you guys I am so happy right now I can hardly contain myself like seriously I got this box um, in the mail and I just ripped it open and I was like OMG I opened the one box they all came in a box I opened the one box and went in took it out I've heard of this fragrance before, but I had never smelt it. When I tell you it's real, it's real. Pull up a chair, 2.5, get a snack, we're gonna be here for a minute. We've gotta talk about these fragrances. To save us a little time, I've already taken all of the fragrances out of their beautiful box that they come in, but I do wanna show you the box, you guys. Here is the box of what it comes in. It says the name on their beautiful white box, gold writing, the attention to detail is there. You're just gonna go ahead and press through there, and when you press through there, it releases this. There is a beautiful coffin that the fragrance sits in, and then it really does look like this. They are gorgeous. The attention to details is just absolutely everything. I love this little thing here. It looks like Roski crystals. It looks like a diamond. Okay, I tell myself it's a diamond. We are fancy and fabulous, darling. It is a diamond. This is a roja we are speaking about. I am gonna start with danger. If you have danger, if you've smelt danger, you guys, then go ahead and let's start some dialogue. Leave your thoughts down below. Perhaps you can help someone. I am going to go ahead and just spray it. Like I said, these these are this is their lighter collection that they have recently come out with, and it's a 2021 release. It is beautiful. Like I said, I just feel that this is a lot lighter and a lot probably easier to wear especially right now in spring and summer than some of the other ones would be I know my favorite um, at the time was 51 and that is a little bit heavier on the original brand compared to the 51 that came out in the collection here in the essence de parfum collection it's a lot lighter it's a lot easier to wear it can go from day to night okay girl can you please focus you guys I'm so excited Roja, thank you so kindly for sending these over. I truly, truly appreciate you. Okay, you guys, we're starting with Danger. I'm just gonna spray it here. We'll get a whiff and a look at the atomizer here. Here's what the bottle looks like. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Royalty, the beautiful purple. It almost looks like it's ombre. If it gets lighter or darker, it's just a beautiful bottle. Okay, so here it is. Go ahead and spray. You see, I have not played with these. Oh my gosh. It smells powdery. Smells powdery. This one here is an oriental. I'll give you a few notes, just a few. Uh, bergamot, jasmine, rose, musk, patchouli. Um, it's definitely a spring floral fragrance is what I get. It's a warm, spicy, it's an oriental. It's definitely a floral fragrance. What would you get? Dressy? I can't see this as a dressy fragrance. Can you? I can, but I can see it. Yeah, I get dressy vibes. You can wear this on a Sunday afternoon shopping, tea, brunch. It fits that whole lifestyle. It fits that whole lifestyle right there. The jasmine is there. Like I said, it's a warm, spicy. It's definitely a floral. It's not really heavy, heavy like an oriental, but it's definitely an oriental fragrance. Danger is definitely a great way to go. That is danger. I'm gonna move on. I'll be back to tell you about longevity. Oh, that is really nice. 
Oh, that's good. I'll be back to tell you about longevity, performance, and everything like that, and where I've worn them to, and you know, if I received any compliments or not. Let's keep going. I am now gonna go with Reckless. I've heard a lot about this one. I tried this one in the original line, and I really did like it, so that is this one here. Reckless, same bottle, same setup. This is a, fin a vanilla. This is a vanilla. Oh, I smell green there. Mmm, and some pepper. You know I like pepper. This is a floral. Um, orange, mandarin, yeah, pink pepper, rose, musk, beautiful. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I don't even know which one I would like. I'm not gonna have to choose, right? Yeah, this is more of an oriental. This is definitely more oriental. This one here is definitely more floral. Oh my gosh, but this is good. Okay, so far, oh my gosh, are you saying it? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna decide. It's too soon, I'm not choosing anybody, I'm not. This one right here is really, really good. Oh God, yes, it's good. Oh, is this gonna be my scent of the day? And I love this cap, you guys. Can you see the attention to detail here? That is the signature of Roja. Oh my God, it's heavily weighted. It's got some nice little, um, it looks like cutouts of diamond crust. Everything is a diamond with me, you guys, but it's gorgeous. The cap is heavily weighted. If you could see that there, his initials are there or his signature is there. This is gorgeous. I love fragrance bottles like this. This sitting on your dresser or your vanity or wherever you place your fragrances, you wake up in the morning and when you look at your collection, you just smile. You just get excited because it's just beauty. And I love all things beauty. I move on. This one is called Scandal. Scandal. Oh my gosh. I believe this is like a white floral. We'll get that atomizer. Oh, that's different. Mmm. That's different. It's definitely a white floral. I will say that. Bergamot, orange blossom. It's got some tube rolls in it, jasmine. It smells like a flower. Oh my God, it's beautiful. That's the thing, his ingredients are so rich. His quality is so high. It has such high quality and you know, the ingredients are there and it's always so well blended. It's just blended to perfection. Sandalwood, musk, this is good. Oh my gosh, this reminds me of like a childhood memory. Automatically, this one gave me a, um, a memory of me as a girl. Um, I love when fragrances do that to me, when they can transport me somewhere, when they can you know, send me back to a time and place. That's what I really, truly love about fragrances. It, more than just you know how they smell, is how they make me feel. It's like music for me. I oftentimes tie fragrances to memories and like I said, how it makes me feel. And that's the same thing I do with music. You know, you can hear a song and you'll be like, oh, my mom used to play that back in the day or I was living here when that song came out it just strikes a memory and that's what fragrance does and it really immediately right upon me spraying this it I remember this this is very familiar to me this is scandal um I don't get like scandal like sexy like like that I get a very nice white floral but sexy a white floral but sexy done right so like a you know a classy sexy scandal you know what i mean definitely a beautiful fragrance i don't know what that memory is but gosh it's, it's it's definitely from when i was a girl i think it may just be i played outside a lot you guys that's probably why i don't like outside right now i played outside a lot when i was a child and there was always bees and flies and <laughs> where are you going with this and butterflies and all that kind of stuff. It kind of reminds me of being outside around the white florals and the flowers, um, the rose bushes, the garden, everything like that. That's what it smells like. It's really, really pretty though. Definitely love this one. Okay, I have to move on, I have to move on. This one, I have no notes of what's in here or anything. I didn't see anything, you guys. I just have to tell you. This one here is called Creation E. Automizer there. Oh, very good automizer. Do you see that? It's wide, it's pressured. This right here, this hits different, okay? This hits different. This is gorgeous, darling. I don't know, this is me. This is me in a bottle, like one of me, a part of me in a bottle. This is sexy, oh my gosh. This is date night, this is pin my hair up. Let me get a bold red lip on. Oh my gosh, where are we going? What are we doing? Who's ordering for me? Am I ordering for myself? Are you getting my chair? Are you getting my table? Um, What bag should I rock tonight? This is definitely giving me going out date night vibes. Very sexy. Would you wear this? No, th I this isn't something, this isn't what I would reach for for brunch. Unless it was like a sexy kind of brunch. You know, we're gonna go down on, you know, 
maybe like the the coast or the cove and we we're gonna have like a rooftop type of brunch or by the ocean or something sexy like that you know what i mean it would be for that kind of brunch but yeah very sexy oh this would be a great one to take on vacation too if it was just gonna be you your bae your guy your boo your bae okay whoever makes you happy this is a one and done oh this is good oh this is good creation e okay you heard it here creation e good good I move on. I have another one and I'm, I don't have any of the creation um, line and I have never smelt any of them. So I am extremely excited and very thankful that you sent these over. Thank you so much again. I cannot stress it. Here is another one. This is called Creation R and this looks like this. It looks the same way you guys. The bottles are all the same. I believe they're all in the same line, the same family, the Essence de Parfum. And this is what this one looks like. And let's see what this smells. Now, one of these, I don't know now because there's two creations. One of these I smelled in a car and I lost my mind. And I think it was that one. I think it was that Creations E. Let's move on. Okay, Creation R. Oh, see? I like it hot, heavy, spicy, a little bit more intense. This is, or was it this one? I don't know. Both of these are amazing. Both of, all of them are amazing. But you know, I like a little spice, a little kick, a little umph, a little something. These are all good, you guys. You cannot go wrong. Um, which one out of all of them that you have reviewed for us today would you say would be the sexiest? In my opinion, okay? Just going off a of first impression, in my opinion, I'm going to have to say Creation E. If you have not smelled this one, you need to. Get a whiff of it. Creation E, this right here, okay? It is good, good. They're all good, good, you guys. They, they are all amazing fragrances. But you know, I'm talking about what I like, what I gravitate, what I reach towards, what my heart goes after, beats really fast. I get all, you know, discombobulated, shook up, talk to the bottle, you know, touch the bottle, love the bottle. This is it. Creation E is absolutely phenomenal, okay? This is my first impression. I can't tell you longevity, anything like that. All I can tell you is that it's good, good. Which one do I feel would be safe? That might even be worth a good safe blind buy. If you like white floral, I'm gonna say Scandal. I'm gonna recommend Scandal, but it is sexy, but it is safe. I found it to be classic, you know what I mean? Like I said, I've smelt it before. I've been there, it took me to a time and place. They're all exceptional quality, very well blended. Yeah, this one is very familiar for me. It's very familiar, but very rich, very classy as I you know, come into it again. Scandal is definitely, you you know, you could probably blind by that. And I'm not encouraging you to, but I'm just saying, if you were thinking, I wanna get something from the collection, I think that one would be a great way to go. Let's revisit Reckless again, just so I can see what it gives me now. I would say Reckless would be more um, upbeat, uh, bergamot, citrus notes in the beginning, fruity, pink pepper. It would be really nice. I think Reckless is really nice too. And it's a floral, but it, more fruity, more citrus, more bergamot is what I'm getting in the beginning. It's really, really good. Oh my gosh, it kind of reminds me of, kind of, kind of, you guys, I'm just using this as an example. Kind of reminds me of Tom Ford's Portofino. Is that what I'm trying to say? Yeah, kind of somewhat in that realm is where I'm, I'm saying, if I were to give you something. Yeah, it's really good. Oh my gosh, that one's good. They're all good. Oh my gosh, I'm not being any help today. I'm sorry, you guys. They're all good. I wanted to share them with you. Danger. I love Danger. Um, This one was the Oriental. I am an Oriental lover. It's not as heavy as the normal Oriental. This is a lighter take on an Oriental. So it says it's an Oriental. It performs like an Oriental. I'm going from what I've read, but it doesn't, you know, have that what is it? It doesn't have that, you know, heaviness of an Oriental. That's what I was looking for. Okay, let me see. Let's go back to this one more time. Oh God, danger's good. I do smell powder in the beginning. I don't know where I'm getting that from. It could be the rose, the must, the patchouli. I don't know. Uh, it, it's a white floral. It's a warm, spicy. It's good. They're all good. Oh my gosh. Have you ever had like five fragrances? And I just brought out 51 too to show you. But if you've watched the channel, you've already seen my review on this because this is sexy. This is sexy. This is classy. This is definitely my date night. Get your entire life. Love this. And it is lighter. It's much lighter, you guys, than the original. A lot of you were like, Sheree, I can't smell it. I want to let you know that they do have a body cream. I did go on their website and see that they did have a body cream. So if you want to get it to last or 
project a little longer. Maybe check out the body cream. Other than that, I would just say heavy spray. I heavy sprayed it. I sprayed my clothes. I sprayed my hair. I was wearing something that wouldn't stain, so I felt comfortable spraying my clothes. So, but if you, you know, are wearing white or silk or anything like that, we all know, please, you know, don't spray your clothes. But I'm just saying, and mine did last. You know, it gives me a good five to six hours. I am, let's say it together, I am a huge over sprayer like I can over spray I go in I do the sprinkler system I walk through it the water hose system you name it I'm getting the fragrance on okay and this one here is so sexy oh this is good this this is really good oh my gosh they're all good they're all amazing fragrances I have nothing but good things to say I have nothing I mean there was not one that I'm like oh I don't like this or oh I wouldn't rock this I wouldn't wear this they're all gonna fit a different occasion in my life I'm gonna use them all and rock them all this spring and summer so I'll probably be you know doing a little bit more wear test, playing with them a little bit more. So keep your eyes open. They'll probably be in some countdown videos, top 10 videos, most worn videos. So keep an eye out for that. Rosia, thank you again so much for sending these over. I truly appreciate you and congratulations on another beautiful, beautiful, exciting release on Essence de Parfum. Until next time, guys, you know the drill. All of the information will be linked with links where you can shop for any of these fragrances in the description box below. So make sure you check that out there. And that is it for this video. Until until next time, you know the drill. Be blessed, stay fit, stay fabulous. Thanks for watching. Bye.